Let's unwind our whole body tonight with these awesome stretches. So to start, we'll have a nice bend in our knees. We're gonna spread our fingers apart. We'll bend our neck to one side and come back up. We'll bend to the other side, come back up. I like to imagine somebody's pulling me up by my ear. And I also like to imagine I'm trying to touch the ground with my fingers. That helps bring my shoulders away from our ears. If you feel any pain, back off. We're not trying to force anything, we're trying to unwind tonight. Breathing naturally, heels pressing into the ground. Let's do one more. Come back up. Great. Next, we'll have that bend in our knees. We're gonna breathe in as we open up. Breathe out as we bring our chin to our chest, come down. Now we're gonna breathe in as we open up, we twist to one side. Breathe out as we bring our chin down. Breathe in, open up, twist to the opposite side. Breathe in, breathe out, go down. Breathe in as we open. Breathe out as we come down. So we're alternating sides as we twist. Feels so good on the spine. Shoulders away from the ears. You can even wiggle your fingers while you're doing this. So you're not shrugging your shoulders. Let's do one more on each side. Feels so good. Breathe in, breathe out. Last one. Breathe in, breathe out. Awesome. Next, we're gonna stand nice and tall. Hands are by our sides. We're slowly gonna slide our hand down one side, come back up, slide down the other side, come back up. Just simple little slides. Unwinding the spine, breathing, going at your own pace. Next, we'll just twist a little bit one direction We'll keep sliding. So now your back hand is sliding near your bum, on your bum. Come back up, we'll twist the other side. Slide up and down. Just unwinding that spine. Let's do one more. Breathing. All right. Next, your feet can be a little bit wider than your shoulders. We're gonna do hip circles. You can make big hip circles or small. I'm gonna make some medium circles right now just to unwind the hips. Going in one direction. Try to keep your upper body as stationary as possible. So we're gonna focus on those hips. Heels pressing into the ground. Our hips can hold so much tension from the day, so it's nice to unwind them. Let's go the opposite direction. Imagine you're hula hooping. Woo. Try to keep that upper body still. It's a reminder for myself also. Two more circles. Last one. All right. Next, we're gonna unlock our hip flexor. So we'll bring one foot forward, one foot back. The back leg is straight, so your heel can come off the ground as well. Imagine you have a belt buckle. We're gonna tuck our hips underneath so my belt buckle's facing forward. Right now, when it's untucked, my belt buckle's facing down. So tuck those hips underneath, belt buckle's facing forward. You should feel a nice activation in your glute and in that hip flexor. And from here, we're slowly just gonna bring our chin to our chest and come back up. You can hold onto a chair or you can hold onto a wall for support if you like while you do this. But as we bring our chin to our chest, that helps increase that stretch. Keeping those hips tucked, the belt buckle facing forward. If you wobble a little bit, that's okay. Do one more and come back up. So let's switch sides, the opposite foot's in the front. Back leg is straight, tuck those hips underneath. Again, you can hold onto something if you need it. Bring our chin to our chest, go 
come back up. You might feel one side's tighter than the other. This side is much tighter for me. But our hip flexors can tighten so much during the day from sitting. They can pull on our lower back. Not feel good. So this is a great way to unwind them. Breathing, chin to our chest. Let's do one more. Those hips tucked. And come back up. Awesome. For our last movement, we're going to wake up. Actually, we're going to unwind. Hopefully, we won't wake them up too much. Unwind our ankles. So we're just going to make the biggest circle with our heel in one direction as we can. You can even bring your hands by your side to unwind your upper back. Let's go the opposite direction. So you're on the toes the entire time. Just activating those ankles. Let's do one more. Switch sides. So come up on the toes. Try to make the biggest circles with your heels as you can. You might realize one side's easier than the other. Looks like I'm doing a weird dance move. <laughs> the opposite direction. So, so glad you wiggled with me tonight. Got our whole body from head to toe. One more and come down. Awesome job on that nighttime wiggle. If you would like more stretches like this, then click the link in the description below. Have a great night.